tornado warning after Green Bay's victory over Dallas kept some fans, the Packers team, and a few Cowboys players inside AT&T Stadium more than an hour after the game Sunday night. The warning began before the Packers and football fans could leave. Coming out of the arena and uh, we got stuck in the traffic when the alarm came on, the emergency alarm came on and said that we had to turn around. Officials issued an all clear more than two hours after the game ended. Well, it was worth the trouble for some of the Packers fans who were there. Pete Cervantes spoke with a couple who just got back from yesterday's game. Packers fans are buzzing returning home from Dallas. They arrived at Mitchell Airport this morning full of excitement. We're a great experience, great stadium. Jeff Wagner and Kevin Franklin, a Cowboys fan, took in last night's game at AT&T Stadium together. Unfortunately, I lost, but <laughs> won. Phoenix and Don Ramirez also watched the game as rivals. All along, I said I thought that they were going to win. She's been reminding her husband of the Packers' victory today. Got to rub it in. That's the fun of it. Packers fans now look forward to Sunday's showdown at the Georgia Dome. I can't wait. I think they're going to go all the way. Kickoff Sunday is set for 2.05 p.m. At Mitchell Airport, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4. A round trip flights to Atlanta from Milwaukee start about $400 a piece. As for game tickets, those also running about $400 for single seats.